Well, Stacey, things got so heated tonight, the school had to call in extra security. We saw two very different groups with very different viewpoints, and tonight they clashed, hitting an emotional breaking point. A peaceful protest turns to shouting. You will go to hell for judging. A deputy breaks up the tension between supporters of the Franklin County High School Gay Straight Alliance. There is a world of support. And those who shame them. You'll have a lot better life. You'll have a joyous life. It happened shortly before the Franklin County School Board meeting to discuss revising its after school club policy rules. Members of the Gay Straight Alliance say they're being bullied for their beliefs and are worried their support group will be shut down. People freak out whenever they hear the word gay. Well, I've been called the f in the hallway or the bathroom and I've also had one time had holy water thrown on me as I was walking down the hallway. I believe it's hate, totally hate. Your sins are a stench in the nostrils of God. Then there are conservative Christians. It's not discrimination, discrimination or hate, it's, it's, uh, it's actually loving them and helping them. Who say this lifestyle is a sin. I love the homosexuals, I do. I want them in heaven with me. And when the Bible is clear that that choice of lifestyle, they're not gonna go there. The school board chairman ordered the audience to complete silence during Monday's meeting while they discussed a new proposal to require parent permission to join any after school club. Now, a lot of folks seemed worried that the Gay Straight Alliance would shut down tonight. That is not the case. The club can continue to operate as usual. Now, come in April, school board leaders will then vote to determine whether or not parent permission is needed before students can join an after-school club. We're live in Franklin County tonight. Megan O'Halloran, Fox 17 News.